Hi, this is Nick from CCTV Security Pros, and today we're in our showroom talking about network video recorders. Our VR units offer all of the latest and greatest technology and features. This is a professional system, and that's necessary when you're building a multiple camera system that needs to be reliable and easy to use. It's simply a better product, better system, better equipment than what you would find in some online retailers or big box stores. And of course, all of our recorders and units come with a full three-year warranty. Live USA-based technical support is included in every product that we sell. Our goal is to help you maximize the value of your security camera system. A lot of our customers like to view their camera systems remotely over the internet, so you can view your HD live video or play back that same video right from your recorder over the internet with no interruption at all and no monthly costs or fees to you. And of course you can watch this video on your smartphone, tablet, PC, or Mac. Our VRs use power over Ethernet. So no need for separate power cables, power sources, just one, one cable from your camera straight to your NVR. This calls for a much easier installation, less time on a ladder, means more time enjoying your brand new CCTV system. IP systems also mean more versatility when connecting cameras. As long as your camera is connected to a network, it can be viewed anywhere. All of our systems also include digital zoom, but with NVRs, this is a, a capability is greatly enhanced due to the higher recording resolutions. Our systems also include advanced motion detect features, which allow you to change times or dates or different cameras where you want to trigger certain events to happen. You can also mask out certain objects that you don't want to be uh, detected at all. Here we have the CSP XTR NVR64. It's an extremely impressive model. It's probably my most favorite product that we sell. Uh, very unique, and I'm going to kind of go over a couple of the reasons why. Um, let's start in the front panel here. We've got two USB ports ready to go for your mouse or your USB thumb drives. There's also a locking mechanism up front that we can actually uh, expose the hard drive base. You don't actually have to open the full system up to get access to the hard drives. You just unlock this little key here, and you can kind of open that up. It uses hot swappable hard drives, and they kind of come in these cool little racks. You kind of slide them kind of right in there. It's pretty neat. So let's take a look at the back real quick. It's a pretty heavy unit. There's a lot of stuff going on in here. So let's take a look here. We've got uh, the two USB ports on the front we already showed you. So there's also two more on the back. So there's uh, just more space for more USB devices, whether they're thumb drives or another mouse if you'd like. Um, also right next to that, we've got our eSATA port. We also have HDMI 1 and HDMI 2. So there's two HDMI ports on the back here, as well as a VGA. So you could use three monitors all at the same time. They're all going to display the same image. You could also set one of those HDMIs to do a, uh, you know, a mirror image, or um, maybe you don't want a redundant image. Maybe you want something a little bit different, like a spot monitor. Um, you know, For instance, if this is a commercial environment, um, you want to have a maybe a monitor on the front door or an entrance way, kind of letting people know that they're being monitored, you could use one of those two HDMI ports to do that. It's a pretty cool feature. Um, you can just plug this USB mouse in to kind of show you where everything's going to go. And it also has a built-in internal power supply. It just uses a standard three-prong plug. Just kind of plug that right in here. And then the other end, going to go right into your wall outlet. Nothing special. Pretty simple stuff there. You're also going to notice that there are two Ethernet ports here. Pretty interesting because uh, a lot of our smaller scale systems like the 4, the 8, and the 16, they do have their own built-in PoE ports. Now, it would be almost impossible to fit 64 PoE ports in the back here. So what this system relies on is external PoE switches. So kind of backing up for a second, uh, we basically use one of these two Ethernet ports to connect straight to your router or your modem. Using a six foot patch cable, you can extend that length. This is just the one that's included. But uh, we recommend plugging one of those two ports into your internet you know, modem, router, whatever you have there. And then one of the other two ports, the one that's not for your internet, would go to your first uh, switch in line. So you're probably not gonna have a 64 port switch. You may need to use a 16 or a 32 port switch and kind of stack them together. And it's gonna be pretty convenient because with 64 cameras, you're probably gonna have a couple runs, maybe a few switches over here, a few over there, and you can kind of join them all together, kind of daisy chain them. So you don't have to run all 64 cameras back to one location. That would be a little, a little crazy if you had to do that. So this is a nice little feature here. So you can kind of uh, submit your cameras differently, put your cameras on one and your uh, internet service on another, so you're not kind of clogging up your network. It's a nice feature. Uh, there's also RCA jacks in the back here, so you can use that for bi-directional audio if you'd like. Uh, pretty cool feature. Not so many people use it anymore, but it is there. Um, another thing that we like to do, I'm going to just kind of flip you right around the back here, or the front again. I did want to show you how this front panel opens up. So this key mechanism here, we're just going to unlock that, get this out of the way. 
and it opens up. And these are hot swappable hard drives, so you can actually have, uh, you know, like I said, you kind of put your hard drive right here, screw it into this little rack, and they kind of slide right in and out. It's pretty cool. And you can have eight hard drives total inside of here with eight terabytes apiece. So that's 64 terabytes total. So you can allocate one terabyte for every single camera that you have here. It's really going to maximize your storage. Uh, as you know, 64 cameras are going to take up a lot of hard drive space, so you're definitely going to want to consider putting more than the base uh, hard drive capacity inside of this. So think about that when you're ordering. Uh, included in the sale too, you're just going to get, excuse me, you're going to get the rack mounting ears. Uh, if you have a server rack, a lot of people like to mount those right in there, kind of keep it neat and clean. It's also going to come with the mounting hardware for your hard drives. Uh, you're also going to get seven more of these. I don't have them in the shop here, just kind of clutter up the table. Uh, you're also going to get the hard drive uh, mounting screws as, the, as well as the rack mounting hardware. And you'll get a user manual too, just kind of help you through the uh, installation process. But very, very impressive unit. It's unlike any of the ones that we sell here. Did forget to mention this does have an Intel processor in it too. So it's a really, really powerful unit. Uh, definitely check this one out if you're uh, looking for an enterprise level system that's capable of up to 64 cameras and the highest possible recording resolutions. This is a 4K model, so you can hook up the uh, displays to a 4K and use 4K cameras. So check this one out. This is a very, very nice unit.